I genuinely think the monkey one is actually the best one, though. Why didn't we pick the fucking monkey Cause one? Because I haven't right? picked this one before. Alright, well, you know now. I know now. It's not too bad, and it will look better than the rest of them did. Alright, I fucking suppose that's alright. Hello, Francis. I came for a good old fashioned pegging. <laughs> <laughs> what are you pegging today? I don't know. It's just like the word of the day. <laughs> oh, but I did the exact same thing again. <laughs> you right over there? I'm not, no. <laughs> right, I'm going to do some quick grinding. So, uh, some quick pegging. Possibly, if I'm watching this, pause the episode. You're holding a lot longer than I thought you would. <laughs> what the pegging? Yeah. Um, <laughs> I was literally about to say <laughs> pegging, by the way. Um, I don't know what's wrong with me here. Oh god, my cranium and hurts. Good. Okay. Okay, I'm here for fucking pegging. <laughs> <laughs> Good old fashioned pegging. Good old fucking pegging. <laughs> you gotta use a fucking rolling pen. <laughs> <sighs> I had my moments. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> The fact you're still laughing about it makes me yeah. proud. Yeah, sorry, I've heard my cranium hurts. Good. Oh, God. Keeping that in then. Yeah, no, that's fine. I'll keep that in. Future me, high five. Ah. Uh, yeah. I'm guessing you still haven't watched The Boys, have you? No. Right, well, the new season was. It's, um. Not tell you too much, but it, it, it's. There's. It's heavily related to the word we keep saying. Yeah. Heavily related. I'm guessing that's Pagan. That'd be right. Well, it's actually probably worse than Pagan. Ain't no bum stuff? Isn't that Pagan? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I like the way like it's really innocent when we're talking about optics. <laughs> Just squeeze up, man. Go okay. on then. Go on then. It's not gay if I do it. Be my guest. Ah, uh, I've already killed you. Like, I'm not gay. It's, it's blue. You've had sex with men. Oh, I'll fuck them. They don't fuck me. That's gay. <laughs> There's legit people out there that like that, though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I was telling you earlier on. Um, like, Two straight guys who have like girlfriends and stuff, and they're like out pumping dudes, and you're mm -hmm. going, hey, Is that not mean you're gay? And he's like, Nah, because I pumped him. And he's like, Does that not make you super gay? Yeah, because you put your penis inside another man's arsehole. Mm -hmm. That probably was not clean. The only time I do that is when I'm pegging someone. John's like, I draw the line. Wait, what? You can have bikes? He's a fucking buggy? Oh, I want a bike. Um. You know, I was like, I draw the line and everything else. Yeah, but pegging. Oh, God. Right, I think I've grinded enough to beat him. I've only grinded one level, so we'll see how that goes. Got the love for grind. Haliaki boom! Oh. Haliaki boom! Haliaki boom! Haliaki boom! Oh, that killed him. Pahero! Hero, please. Hero, ladies. Slang word for fuck. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I got nothing either. Right, I've actually looked up the definition of begging here, yeah. seeing as we're talking so much about it. Uh huh. Right, a woman fucks a man with a strap on yeah. in the ass. Yeah. yeah. So, it was coined by journalist Dan Savage. Of course, Savage was in the fucking name. <laughs> yeah. Like, can I finally get past this fucking blue? Urban Dictionary, here we go. Oh. What? Well, fucking let me on, mate. Ah. Why can't you get an Urban Dictionary? Urban Dictionary is like the fucking best. Have you been banned or blocked or something? I shouldn't. <laughs> Mr. Sidestein, I don't know. Man, that's one dead. <laughs> Imagine being banned from fucking uh, Urban Dictionary. 
Your yeah, fucking dictionary site. Damn. That's like being banned from Countdown. And not because we were watching IT Crowd with Countdown on Not because we were on Street Countdown. <laughs> Ridiculous now, you get me. I was the guy wearing the frog, um... Uh, cardigan going weird all the time. Literally. Oh, Is there actually a lot of white guys to talk like that? Over in that there in London? Aye, bruv, innit? Yeah. It is it like why are you talking like that or is it like just because from where about you're from or is it like trying to be like puppy black i was trying to be yeah. but basically all the above mm, fair enough trying to be black also culture now and because they're fucking retarded or beans yeah. <laughs> she kind you know what i was gonna say like all the characters in this are pretty fucking weird looking and then she comes along and you're just like you're Hitting like, that in the back when those strings attached. Yeah, and she had a cute little giggle like. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! Like, Why'd you like to peg? <laughs> Stop it! I fucking well not. Oh. Ooh. So. <laughs> oh, she'd get it. Front, back, up, down, all around. Then we turn it all the way round. Your rival in this is a bit of a... Twat, yes. Mm, bit of a twat. Although I kind of miss that though. Like in the newer games, they're all like, Hey, let's be friends and battle! Or at least Gary was like, Hey, Ash, you're such a fucking loser. Yeah. I gotta fuck your mom when you're not home. Yeah, literally, you're so pathetic, <laughs> you little cuck. And then he goes home, fucks your mom, and then he... Takes I, have, mom. I have a theory that I've seen other theories, but I'm gonna... Thing, this theory. Uh -huh. Do you think Professor Oak is fucking pegging Ash's ma while he's away? Oh, 100%. Definitely. He's like, yeah, um, take this Pokemon and go out in the field. That, he goes, that's your mom, right? Like, oh, yeah? Like, oh, yeah, fucking do that. Literally. Hey, Ash's mom. Do you like pegging? Our character's lips looks like a pocket anus. Do you know that, don't you? Yeah. That's probably where the peggings come from. <laughs> Oh, call me Peggy. Louise. Why do you call it? Why are you called Peggy? Oh, you know. Yeah. Don't act like you don't know. You know. What am I supposed to be getting stuff from? Is it meant to come from you? Is it the internet? Nope. Um, he has like, do you know one of them froze that are growing out that they're not quite cool yet? They're yeah. like just like fucking. A yeah. young black boy, fro cut. Fucky boy. He had a red hand. He's from Ireland. <laughs> no. Oh, well. No, he's from... Oh, yeah. yeah. Not the red hand. The red right hand. Oh, no, no, no. I don't agree. Why can't I go up there? Sorry, but Tatrix said you can't walk unless you're a trained tamer or one accomplished by one. Maybe I have to grind up a little bit there. So, Sorry, only people who are pegged could come along here. So I basically have to go and get pegged so I can get up here. Okay. Like I did it. Took me a while, but I did it. Took me at least three minutes. Not my first rodeo. Right, how old are I? <laughs> Just slid right in there. Anyone know how I get pegged? Do you, do you know what porn stars use for anal? Uh huh. Poppers. Oh. You know what poppers do? Yeah, what's that? They open up your ass. Ooh. It's a drug. So like a lot of like anal scenes. I think a lot of gay men use it. Um, to open up one's bottom. Now, I have a couple of theories on... Say... What? That person sat down, so I sat down. Huh. <laughs> Just a hole in the floor. Yeah. <laughs> Egged. Um, I wish. I have a theory though, right? If you take a poppers and opens up, yeah, yes. Yeah. What if you need like a Tuesday? Just falls out. Do you put it back in? Yeah. Okay. So you go, John. You learned something today. Exactly. I wonder, can you OD on poppers? Like the, this find you land on the floor with a giant asshole? Maybe. Should we find out? You got pops? We can get pops. I know a guy. I peg a guy. <laughs> I peg a guy who uses it. I peg a guy who knows a guy. <laughs> I peg a guy who's pegged another guy who knows a guy. Hashtag massive Wait, what, what does he want me to do? Alright, read it out again. Find you and Okay. 
You find this paper in the emporium. Acquire a file of of something from thingy because he wants me to do something. I think I have to catch a Pokemon for him. I think that's what it is. John, we don't call them Pokemons here. They're Tam Tam thingies. I've got one sip of paper. Woo! Go me. I'll be at the Nanga Temporium. Fucking racist bastard. Nanga Wings. He looks like he's like a peg. <laughs> right. I call him Peggy Mitchell. I call him Bootylicious Barry. <laughs> Bountiful Booty. Right. Uh, I, mean, I don't know. Bring me Temtem. Oh. Any Temtem from Precinct Coast. East right. to the coast. These are the things I love the most. Yeah, toast! I need to go down here. And capture a Pokemon. Or peg it. Whatever makes you feel good. Oh yeah, they're peggers. I'll peg a Pokemon. They're three-way they're three pegs. Hmm. Time to peg. Do 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 duel. Or strap ons. Or just bigger Dwayne Johnson decks. Yeah. Hi, I'm Wayne the Rock Johnson. I'm cutting a lot of this bullshit out because this is just us rambling while we're trying to grind for shit now. Yep. Good. Yeah, you got a lot of cutting out to do, sir. Yeah, I will be cutting and editing. Cutting and pasting. And the other thing. Peggy. And I, I can't stop saying it. It's addictive, right? Yeah. Like. Like. Butt stuff. Butt things. Oh. The fucking stupid Temtem killed itself trying to kill me. Fuck's sake. It was too busy doing. Them two were doing dick stuff before you came and found uh -huh. them. That's why they looked so surprised when we showed up. <laughs> oh, Jesus. They were like, oh, we're not doing anything. Oh. I was gonna stick this stick up this duck's ass. And I was gonna let him! <laughs> um, anyway, John, how do you feel about the global climate? Do you think David Attenborough's doing enough to save the planet? No, he should be getting pegged more. Oh, he's, def he's definitely pegged a fucking seagull or something. If he has, it should be on fucking Animal Planet. Or Big Blue World or whatever it's called. Oh, yeah. No! I don't know, you usually know what it is, boys. And now, uh, we go back. David Attenborough. And today, we see... Uh, the lot dial pegging a giraffe. <laughs> Nature is a beautiful thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. Um, <laughs> now, we see... Crocodile going fucking berserk. Arizona, you will see. Arizona, Arizona. You will see. how will settle. Crocodile by jamming his thumb straight up his arse. I actually heard that once. And although none of you have asked, that is also how you calm me down. <laughs> <laughs> I. <laughs> Don't judge. It's just nice. <laughs> Sometimes I sit down and have my modern cup of tea. And it falls out and I think, oh, I left that in from the night before. That is what I call Animal Planet Butt Plug. I'd subscribe. It's actually a extinct rhino's horn that I shaved down, molded, and stuck straight up my ass. Humankind is a fucked up thing. Imagine like all the historical people who are fighting wars to like have rights and things. Mm -hmm. And then we're sat in here talking about shoving shit up our ass. Well, think of it this way, John Bala, right? There yeah. is so much shit going on in the world. Uh -huh. And if you can't sit and laugh about David Attenborough having shit up his ass. Yeah. And watching him peg other animals. Uh -huh. Then what can you talk about? Exactly. Yes, we know David Attenborough is a fucking treasure. We get it. But you know... It's like Steve Irwin. He used to wrestle crocodiles. He definitely jammed a thumb up some fucking croc's ass, like. Isn't that um, Crocodile Dundee? Yeah. No, Crocodile Dundee's a film. No, but isn't that the guy it was based on? Yeah, Crocodile Hunter. Sure.
Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you like our video, please like and subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye! Bye.